You know it's me when you hear that. Dead is. This is Henny and Fried Crabs, and the world now is in an uproar. Where the love go? Where the love go? Hot, hot, two, three, I let one go. Bow. Kendra Lamar has just been selected for Super Bowl 59 halftime show, and everybody is upset. From the likes of Juvenile, Nicki Minaj, Birdman, Master P, everybody in New Orleans, and a lot of people in the hip-hop are mad that they didn't choose Lil Wayne. Well, the Super Bowl has been in New Orleans at least 10 times, but only probably three times since Lil Wayne has been a big-time artist in 02 and 2013 where Lil Wayne was not selected. So I'm confused why y'all are all angry that they chose the hottest hip-hop artist right now. Kendra Lamar is at the top of the food chain. He took out Drake. He's an easy, easy pick if you ask me. And on another side, let's be clear. Do we really want to see Lil Wayne perform? I don't know if any of y'all ever been to a Lil Wayne show. He's the worst performer ever. Yes, he has a bunch of hits clearing all genres. So yes, he could probably bring out rock bands, R&B people. I get it. But I don't want to see a Lil Wayne show. He has no performances. He's not going to bring choreography. He's not going to bring art. He's not going to bring originality. He's going to stand in the middle of the stage the whole time and just do his raps. And sometimes he's going to forget his raps. I've been to plenty of shows where he's forgetting his raps. So I don't know why Nikki is such an uproar. She went on tweeting, denying a young black man what he rightfully puts into this game for no other reason but your ego. What? What are y'all talking about? Jay-Z actually rocks with Lil Wayne. One nigga took a knee. The other nigga took a bag. Okay, yes. Jay-Z did do some little bull job with the NFL. That's cool. But Birdman, hating shit for real. These pussies, Nicki Minaj, Drake, Lil Tunchi. YMCMB, I'ma make these niggas respect this song, Gladys, huh? I just wanna know, where was Nicki and where was all this energy Birdman had for Lil Wayne when he owed the 14 million in taxes? Huh? Huh? Where were you? Cause we know who bailed him out. He said it, Jay-Z. Where was Juvenile? Where were all these people who were mad when Birdman wouldn't pay you. Birdman, you wouldn't pay him. He had to sue you. So I don't know why y'all all jumping on this Lil Wayne train. Yes, Lil Wayne is a great artist. He's probably top 10 all time. He has a lot of hits. He's not Super Bowl performance, though. And I know that's some true reality for y'all. He's just not a Super Bowl. Bo performer. If you've ever seen Kendrick Lamar perform, he just finished one of the uh, biggest rap tours off his album, Mr. Morale and the uh, Steppers. Man, it's one of the greatest shows you'll ever see. It's on Amazon now. I just challenge you to go watch that. Have y'all seen what he did at the Grammys? Kendrick Lamar is going to get on stage and give the world a message. He's going to represent us. So I don't know why all these black people mad. Lil Wayne is the same person who said he don't know what Black Lives Matters is. He doesn't know what racism is. He's a blood. I'm, I'm a blood. He said this on ABC. So I don't know why y'all are so bent out of shape and trying to protect a, a guy who don't give two shits about you. Because ain't no white people mad. Ain't no white people standing up saying, oh, why Lil Wayne is y'all. And Wayne don't see what, he, what is Black Lives Matter. What is racism? Man, go sit your little high ass down. We don't want to see nobody on stage. Just every song about drinking lean, smoking weed, and being the blood that you're not. You're not my paru. Stop it. We'd rather see Kendra Lamar, period, who's going to give the black people something, who's going to show the world something. He's going to have a message. So, we don't care. There it is.